Their backs are against the wall. The Minutemen can't really afford another loss if they want to make the playoffs, which means today's game at James Madison is huge. And let's start with the first drive of the game. The toss to Jonathan Hernandez, who sprints for a 26-yard gain. Hernandez, 145 yards on the ground. That leads to a field goal. But the offense stalls for the rest of the half, allowing the Dukes to come back. In the second, Jamal Sullivan breaks a few tackles, just gets into the end zone, 7-3 JMU. Less than 30 seconds in the half. The Dukes knocking on the door again. Sullivan punches it in. UMass down 14 to 3 at halftime. But the Minutemen taking some chances in the second half. Fourth and eight on the JMU 28. Kyle Havens finds Anthony Nelson with a great catch in traffic. That leads to a field goal, so it's 14-6. The momentum shifting after this play here. The Dukes with a big third down. And Antoine Tharp just crushes the receiver, forcing a punt. And a big return leads to this on third and goal. Havens finding Julian Talley on a quick slant. Two-point conversion is good, so we are all tied up. The Minutemen D stop JMU on a fourth down. Try, so the offense with the ball. Second and goal from the one. Havens to Andrew Crevis. UMass takes a 21-14 lead. Now remember, UMass D didn't stop Richmond on its final drive a few weeks ago, but co-captain Tyler Holmes making sure that doesn't happen again. A big sack here seals the win. UMass a 21-14 winner.